Sorry to turn still into it. I'm getting ready to go to the airport. I just got out the shower and I'm ready to go for real. If you don't take a shower before you go on a flight, I don't got too much to say to you, bro. Because you are dirt! Hey, man, I, you sit next to all these people, you in an enclosed environment, and you smell dirty? You tripping! Anyways, it's about 8 o'clock right now, so I didn't have to wake up too early this time. But looks like I'm about ready to go, man. So we about to go to the hold up. Hold up. Wait a minute. Something ain't back. I didn't even pack my clothes. I didn't even realize I didn't pack my clothes, bro. How? So I guess that's what I'm about to do right now. I know you don't really care about all the stuff that's going in the suitcase. So boom, man. And just like that, we are packed and ready to go. So now it's time for me to leave. Let me. Yeah, it's time for me to go. I'll catch y'all when I start on the way. Time to get on the road. The line near the top of the screen is the route that we should have taken, but the pilot said we had to avoid a big storm and go all the way around. So we in the hotel room now, and this spot is very nice, very spacious. Look at the bathroom, man. Stop playing, bro. The downstairs was crazy, man. The lobby had everything. Then we got this living room right here. Oh my goodness. Next, we got the bed and the window. This nice little view of the city, man, is so tough. Stop playing with them, man. It's hard. Got the Buck Stadium right there, Pfizer Forum, which is where I'll be working at all week long. So I'm super excited for that. They asked me to come out, take some pictures and videos for them. So you know the kid had to slide. Next up, we got some bags there, bags there. Got my jacket there, I'm gonna clean that up. But then we got a speaker up here, man. But then we got a nice setup, man. This is where I'm gonna be working from all week long as well. When I'm not at Pfizer Forum. So basically, that's all I got for right now. I'm gonna check back in later or even tomorrow when I got something really to record, so. Peace. Good morning from your boy. I uh, just woke up earlier and actually I've done a little bit since I last ended the vlog. Last night I finished up a really big mixtape for a college player and then went to sleep right after. But then this morning I woke up earlier than I set the alarm for, went down, got some breakfast. The breakfast was banging. Oh my goodness. Yo, they got some fire food here. Afterwards, I went to Walmart and check me out, right? Look at this. I had to get me a portable charger because uh, rookie mistake, but I left my portable charger at the crib. Just charging it up for the game. The game starts at 5.30 today, but I'm getting there like 12 o'clock. So that's gonna be pretty sick though. I can't lie. But definitely need a portable charger in that case because being there for five and a half hours before the game even start, taking pictures and videos, and these camera batteries don't even barely last an hour. Then you got the game right after, so I couldn't even get no little portable charger. I had to get one of them big boys. So that one does like 46 hours of charging. It's crazy. Just waking up to the view this morning, it was so cool, man. Just seeing everything out here, man. I like it, I like it. So now basically, I'm just organizing some stuff on the laptop, waiting for the game to get closer. Also, I never rode Uber before, and Milwaukee's the first time I've ever rid, ridden in Ubers before. The guy who took me from the airport to here, we talked very little. Then the second Uber I took, which was this morning to go to Walmart, that dude was like spitting game, like telling me like how to make money and like all this and that. He was putting me on, right? And then the third dude who I took, he said, good morning. Didn't talk the entire rest of the time. So I don't know if you like supposed to talk to the Uber people or not. I don't got no idea, man. Let me know in the comments. So I just got done some more work, organizing the laptop and everything. And now it's almost time to leave. So I'm gonna go ahead and put my cameras away, get all my stuff packed up and ready to go. And then I'm gonna walk on over to the stadium because it's not even raining right now. It's actually pretty sunny, which is crazy. And it's, it says it might snow tonight, but yeah, so I'm about to go right now. All 
All right, so we in the telly. I've been working for the past probably hour or so, and I ordered some Domino's. I was eating good too, boy, but now I'm just working on these pictures. Hey, Rick. You feel me, man? We I've just been, you know, working, man, doing my thing. So, gotta work on these pictures some more. I got some finished of my boy Jay Crowder. Yes, sir. Also, I got two of these Red Bull things. I've never tried Red Bull before. So I guess we're gonna have a taste test right now. So I never even wanted to try one of these before, but this was like the only type of caffeinated drink that they had here. And I'm not trying to fall asleep right now because I'm trying to work and grind out all these pictures and videos right now. Alright, here we go. It smells ah, not that good. It smells like medicine. Oh, whew, tastes like medicine too. I'm not really liking it. Oh, man, and, and people be drinking these for fun? Casually? about these boy oh no yeah it's not growing on me at all but besides all of that this is the pass that I got today they spelled my name wrong crazy man can't believe it but hey it is what it is also I got this wristband I just say bucks playoffs on it they put it on my bag, they didn't even offer to put it on the wrist. But that's pretty cool too, another little souvenir. Other than that, I'm gonna just keep on working, drinking this nasty stuff. Catch y'all soon, man. Man, you already know, bruh. It actually snowed. That's so crazy to me, bruh. It was so warm, it was almost 80 degrees here yesterday, and I was snowing. Yo, so it's probably been like two days since I picked up a camera. I just been working a whole bunch on the videos and pictures, man. Go check out the videos on Floaty Noah on Instagram. But today is game day. Game number two at home in Milwaukee. So we gonna be going to that once again. I'm gonna be getting there dumb early like I did last time too. And go chop it up with some of the players, man. And we just gonna see what's up with today, man. Hopefully we can get the dub. Because I was not too happy with the outcome against Miami in the first game. But let's see what we can do this game. And I'm going to catch y'all once I go to the game. Alright, man. So it's just about time for me to head on over to the game. I think we're going to go with this shirt for tonight's game. Boom, man. The fifth for the night. And it is currently some good thunder and lightning out there raining right now do i walk the three minute walk over there i probably because i feel like if i uber then they're not gonna know where to drop me off because i gotta go to the entrance where the miami heat players come through and i don't know if they know how to get there walking to the game right now and it is freezing cold i only brought the jacket so i could cover my book bag if it really started raining but it just got done raining <laughs> it's so cold oh my goodness done it once again got the pass this time they spelled my name right so we really valid these were just a few clips before the game started at the arena completely empty it seems so small when it's empty but when it gets filled all the way up it's crazy because it feel a lot bigger i also added in a couple of clips of a few players warming up before the game here goes the nasus I also got a clip of Chris Middleton getting some shots in the short corner. And lastly, we got Gabe Vincent. I got a whole lot of videos on the Floaty Noah Instagram page. And just like that, man, another successful evening at the Bucks playoffs. Game two, got a ton of pictures and videos of all the players from both teams. Uh, swapped more info with different players from both teams, man. So 
just getting the getting the word out there, man. Getting the content out there. I also received some free game from one of the players' managers tonight about how I could change and improve my portfolio. And I'm definitely gonna start doing this. I'm excited though, man. Big things coming for sure. Chopped it up with a couple players as well before and after the game. Like Joe, yo, Joe Eagles is the coolest dude, bro. But I was chopping it up with my boy Marjan on the Bucks. Jamal Kane from the Heat, man. Just the list goes on. I'm not gonna bore you with all the names. Hey, so just like that, we back in the telly. Already working, man. And yo, I, I'm, I'm gonna try a different flavor tonight of this stuff, man. I can't believe how bad it tastes. But hopefully this tastes better because I do love me some watermelon. But yeah, now we're just working on these flicks and send them to the players. Same old, same old, but we got to stay up late tonight. It's about 12. Let me see. It's 1123 Central Time. So that means I got to stay up late, late, late. But it's all a part of the job. So let's do it. I ain't here to complain about how terrible this is because this is a super dope experience above anything else. Extremely blessed to be in this position to do this. The way that all the pieces connected to lead me to this just is incredible. And, and I cannot be grateful enough. Now the next day, last night was a movie, man. So today I woke up, got some breakfast, and then went to the gym. And I just got back from the gym, so chilling. Today, really, all I got is just editing these videos up, and then I gotta pack up my stuff for tomorrow, cause tomorrow's when I'm leaving. So gotta take care of that for sure. It's been such a dope experience, though, man. I can't even lie. Last day, just woke. Uh, super tired for no reason. This is the first day I've actually been tired when I woke up. But about to go get some breakfast, get all my stuff packed up, and then we going back to the airport. I'm gonna go get me some food, man. <laughs> all right, so we outside the hotel now. Just got done packing up everything. Ready to leave, just waiting for the ride. Just done being my favorite team, it's pretty cool just like, staying in the hotel right next to the stadium. And it was also obviously cool to go film all the players and chop it up with all of them. Yes, sir. We back in the garage, bro. Yo, I took a risk, bro. I didn't know where I was at, but I took the risk, got off the bus. I was just like, man, if it's not here, I'm gonna figure out a way, but it's here. Cause I don't know, I'm just like that. I just know what I'm doing. It's been so cloudy. Out in Milwaukee every single day, raining, snowing, just clouds, terrible. But I land here, man, look at that. It's a beautiful sight to see. They welcoming me back. Hey, that's all I got for this vlog, though, man. Y'all gonna see some footage. Uh, super dope experience. Hopefully, I'll be back out soon. And other than that, man, it's been your boy.